We're gonna start this morning off with a stretch. Yeah. Cause it's like 6.35. Saturday morning. Look what's in the back. We're on our way to go get mommy's new rims. I think we're gonna stop by Starbucks. This is the last look of what her car looks like with the stock rims. The front we can adjust down further. We just haven't because we're gonna be putting the new rims on. Once we get the new rims on then we can uh, look to see how much further we can go down because the new rims are about an inch shorter in diameter so that's a half inch on top half inch on bottom so give us another half an inch of lowering the front end so yeah that's what we're doing and if you guys wanted to know yes a toyota 86 can fit a set of ooh, let's get this forward 18 inch tires <laughs> here let me widen this out see 18s. Hell, you could probably put 20s back here. <laughs> so there's that. We're going to head over to the uh, uh, rim and tire place and uh, pick up the rims. Uh, yeah, see you guys in just a second. I'm tired. I hauled ass to get home last night just so we can get this done. We're going to be working on the Toyota mini truck as well. 89. Toyota pickup, fully bagged. Yeah, let's see what we can do with that thing too. We're here at Big Jake's. They're the ones that are gonna be doing it. That's the last time. Last time we're gonna see him with the rims on. He's got it lifted all the way up right now, so we can get him in here. Like I said, we're here at Big Jake's. We're gonna go in here and sit down for a little bit. All right, she is getting underway. I don't even know where the rims are. I think they got them hidden. Oh, they got them up front up there. Ooh. This guy rolled in here with one lug nut. He's missing four lug nuts and drove in here with one. He said, oh no, my, my vehicle is shaking. Man, you wanna talk about lucky. So we're sitting here, social distancing. They've got all these rims up there. And one of them's the one that we're getting on the car. But you can't tell which one. If you pause it right now, you could try to figure it out. But yeah, they are out there diligently working on everything. And then when we get done here, we got to head over to Gloria's house and pick up some face masks. Looking forward to that. And then after that, then uh, we got to meet up with uh, Mommy. She spilled her hot chocolate. It burned. It burned. <laughs> I got it on my arm and I was like, mm -hmm, just wipe it off. <laughs> yeah, be careful with that. Yeah. But when we get done with all of that, we're going to go meet up with mommy for lunch and give her her car back so that she can go play with it and then uh, come back and start uh, working on the Toyota truck. A little golf. So we'll see you guys in a little bit after they get done. Well, it's going down. There's those. Oh my God. There it is. Almost ready. These guys seriously take their time putting the tires together so they don't scratch your rims. They got that guy in there fixing his lug nuts now. Making sure that he's got new studs. Getting him out the door. Alright. So now what he's going to do is he's going to bring it down on the blocks. That way what we can do is uh, he can let the air out of it and he can check everything to make sure the clearance and everything is, is still good on, on everything. So I wanted to get a shot of this when he first does this. You gotta turn the key on. The key to the back, way back. It's right there. Oh, in a bag. I thought you said in the back. No, bag. You see, I'll be racing if you want to. Now you know you can't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she don't get good fuel mileage in it. Well, hang on. We're gonna transform right now. 
I did it. Man, that looks good. I'm not worried about the top of the tire. I was more worried about the bags in the back. Yeah, that's all I'm worried about is that front airbag. Make sure it's not rubbing. Still can't get under it. Can she lift it up when she wants that button and lift it up too? Yep. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. It's 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 a full air ride system in the back. You can't hear them right now, but there's two compressors in the back, in in the trunk with a with an air tank, and it's getting the air ready again to be able to air it back up. You said you got about one inch. You got about one inch on the bag? Okay. Wow. Yeah. Hell yeah. All right, bro. I appreciate you looking at that for me. Man, that looks sexy. So you put the whole thing in there yourself? Yes, sir. How long did it take? Uh, yeah, it took a couple of days, but if that's because I'm, I'm older, I'm fat, and I take a lot of breaks. <laughs> But it's all documented on uh, on uh, YouTube. That's what this video right here is going to be on. It'll be on YouTube. Whatever. <laughs> that looks like a 4x4. Four four. Hey, put 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 the wheel straight. Right there. You're not gonna drop it? You want it? Mm -hmm. Yeah! That way it's harder for you to get out. <whistles> Sexy. That's my wife's baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So we're sitting here dropping the car off with Gina. <laughs> <laughs> you excited? Mm -hmm. You like the way it looks? I love it. I'm glad. <laughs> now I gotta go get my truck washed. I got all this freaking dirt on the windshield. It's not my fault. Oh. Yeah. Look at that. So pretty. We gotta get her. We're not getting our food. She's gonna take all this stuff to work. I want to get a shot of her airing it up and leaving. Down a little bit. A little bit more. A little down over here. A little bit more. Right there. Hey. Hey. The back is sitting lower than normal, so when you get to like a speed bump or something, air it up a little bit. But you can ride right there all the way to all, all the way to work, and it'll look the best. The front could go down a hair more, but you're good. That's good. Now it's sitting nice. Bye, baby. There she goes, Miss America.
Beautiful. All right. Time for us to head back to, uh, how to go get my truck washed. And then we're going to go to get the rims, put them in storage and then head back to the house and probably take a nap before the next part of this video. Yes, because, <laughs> what? Yes, because I've fallen asleep a couple times and you, woke, and you woke me up by the door. Yeah. Like my <laughs> eyes are boulders. All right. Well, let's get out of here. All right. I haven't been videoing as much. It kind of happens, right? I don't know. This is fogging up. There we go. All right. Uh, we are working on the truck, trying to get uh, just some of the touch-up done. I've got some spots. Uh, this is with uh, 2,000 grit. I've got a little bit of uh, sanding. I'm going to end up buffing this out, but I wanted to get the lines covered up and then buff all this together. I've got tape, <laughs> plastic, and everything on the back. I've already sanded and cleaned the rail. Now I'm going to go ahead and just do the top rail so that it is more presentable. And I still have to go and get a rubber eraser bit or whatever to try to get some of this off and then touch up the rest of what I can't get off. So, and I've got a lot of the scratches that were on the doors and on the other side all cleared up or, or uh, painted over and whatnot. I went ahead and did the whole top up there and uh, we'll get that buff down again make it look nice because I definitely want to be able to get this truck looking good for going out to Slamily so that's why I still haven't gotten these on uh, like I said before I did hammer out a dent that was right here I'd like to try and get that dent right there I want to work on that I think I can get it so it's just a matter of playing with it and I need to get the license plate on the back so that that's all coming up this weekend is basically just beautifying the truck for a little bit and then we can work on just a couple other little things like I said for right now it'll lift up off the ground and it'll get on the trailer it'll even go down the road it just has a little trouble getting over a speed bump <laughs> who doesn't have trouble getting over speed bumps yeah. <laughs> so be right back Ooh, look at that sexy car. Yeah. Oh, so sexy. Well, how does she handle? Awesome. And everybody loves it. Really? <laughs> Good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I haven't checked the other half of the comments that have been popping up <laughs> on Facebook, but everybody's really loving it. If you guys aren't on our Facebook, there is the uh, Earth Scraper 69 page on Facebook, and then there is mine, which is Lawrence Duarte and uh, you can get on there and sometimes we'll upload pictures there ahead of schedule. Uh, Instagram or Scraper69 as well. So yeah, that's where we are. But it looks horrible right now. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll, I'll buff it out tomorrow and uh, hopefully the most of that will buff out and it'll get, it'll look 10 times better. I did the back back here. Problem is, is it's so humid outside. Mm -hmm. It's not curing the way it's supposed to. So you can see the difference where it's not shiny up here, but it is over here on the side. The top is what I did. I'm hoping, I'm not going to keep my fingers crossed, but I'm hoping that when I buff it out, I can buff that and it'll come out shiny. I don't know yet. I don't know. But with it being as humid as it is, I went over it several times making sure that it was wet when I laid it down. And there's just, the humidity in the air is horrible. If we had a shop and we were able, you know, to get it dry in there and run the air conditioners and whatnot, then we'd have a better chance at doing this. So, all we can do is try. But hey, we're going to order some pizza and we're going to call it a night. We'll talk to you guys tomorrow. All right. I moved a little goth over to there. I did have her under here. I wanted to try my 
main truck, my everyday truck, right here to see how it's going to fit in the driveway because I'd like to start parking it over here with it all the way back. I'm actually all the way in the driveway. And it's sticking out. That's pretty cool. I like it. So little goth is over here. I did some work to it to get that all buffed out. It probably needs another good buffing. The hood definitely needs more buffing, but the big white scratches are gone. But now I have this problem because uh, I got to buff the shit out of that and the other spots. But it got too hot on the hood for me to buff. The wax was drying out before I could do anything. But all these are done on the side. They're nice and shiny. Uh, I worked on this. It's not perfect. But it's as perfect as I can get it. So it is nice. It is a lot straighter. This one, although it's not perfect, I did work it out a little bit and then I buffed it out. Uh, the shadow of Toyota is gone off the tailgate. You couldn't see it before, but you can see it now. Got the license plate on the back, a little goth. Uh, I put some uh, water treatment in the tank and filled the tank up with high octane. So uh, I ran it for a little while. It's still doing the same problem. I'm thinking that, that the fuel filters may be clogged up and that's what's causing it because it'll idle, but it's not doing anything more than that. So. I need to uh, order some fuel filters or just go down to the store and get some fuel filters. And that'll take care of that. Uh, I mean, it'll still go on a trailer. I just won't be able to drive through town right now. So I need to get that fixed next weekend. That's what's on the agenda now. I'm down to three weekends left until we go to uh, Slamily. Uh, I believe my wife is going to get the days off for Slamily, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So, I'm kind of excited about that. We'll see how that goes. We'll be able to take the whole weekend off. And she's already put in time for uh, uh, Sparks in the Ozarks. And we're hoping that she can get those days off and we can go to that. Turkey drag, she has that naturally off so that we don't have to worry about that. So that, we are going to be make it, uh, able to make it too. Um, I can't think of anything else. I'm tired. I'm hot. I want to go inside. I'm going to eat some grapes relax and maybe take a nap it's like four o'clock in the afternoon and i gotta go to work tomorrow monday so yeah that's it uh please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already uh, i'm trying to get a little golf worked out so that i can start driving her uh all the buffing that was a big big concern and uh izzy's calling so I'll see you guys in the next video later bro Later, everybody. Freaks.